So, um, hey guys, what's up? It's, um, your boy Aiden here, and we're gonna be doing guitar stuff on this YouTube channel. But not all the time, every, like, couple months or couple weeks or so. But we're gonna be playing this song. I think it's Wagon Wheel, but I can't remember because I'm not that good at... Yeah, it's Wagon Wheel. So, you want to have your feet... Take your pointer, pointer finger, put it on the second fret of the, um, sec second to second fret. Then you want to take your middle finger, you want to put it on the, fir the third fret of the, uh, of the first string. Then you want to take your, uh, ri your ring finger and put it on the third fret of the bottom string and then you want to play and it should sound like this you know and then you want to take your pointer finger you want to put it on the second second fret of the third to last string you want to take your middle finger put on the first the second fret of the last string and you want to take your ri your ring finger put it on the third fret of the third to last string and it should sound like this and then you want to take your pointer finger put it on the first fret of the um second to last string you want to take your middle finger you want to put it on the where is it the second fret of the second the second no yeah, second string, and then you want to take your ring finger, and you want to put it like that, and it should sound like this. Wait, not like that. It should sound like this. I can't do it. <laughs> Boom. It should sound like that, pretty much. And then you want to take your pointer finger, you want to put it on the fir first fret of the second to last string. You want to take your middle finger, put it on the second fret of the, um third to last string and then you want to take your actually no put it on the one above and then put your ring finger on that one I just said and it should look like that with your fingers and it should sound like this oh wait one of my but no so it should sound like that so when you're going through it practice it and it should go like this I'm not that good at it yet but how good I've been getting at it and then like that so um yeah so we're gonna do this you want to take your f fingers we want to go one or one two three four and then you want to go again one two three four you want to go again. One, two, three, four. You want to go one more time. One, two, three, four. And then now we're going to make it a little bit trickier. Every time I hit the four, you're going to play, and then you're going to take your fingers off, and by the time I get to the next four, you want your fingers to be on the same strings and play again. So we're going to go one and a two and a three and a four and then you want to take them off and then you want to put them back on a one and a two and a three and a four and you want to take them off and you want to put them back on and a one and a two and a three and a four and then you want to take them off and put them right back on and then we're going to do a one and a two and a three and a four and then take them off put them on one more time and then we're going to do a 1 and a 2 and a 3 and a 4. And now, we're going to do the D. So th that was the G string. Now we're going to do the D string. So you want to have your f your, in your index finger on the... Yeah, on the second... The third... The second fret of the third to last string. You want to have your... um middle finger on the second fret of the last string 
and then your ring finger on the third fret of the sec the third to last string. And then we're going to do this. And we're going to play it, and then we're going to go. We're going to count to four, and we're going to play it again. One and a two and a three and a four. One and a two and a three and a four. One and a two and a three and a four. One and a two and a three and a four. And then now we're going to make it a little bit trickier by taking our fingers off and putting them right back on by the time I get back to four. So one and a two and a three and a four. One and a two and a three and a four. One and a two and a three and a four. One and a two and a three and a four. Okay? So now we're going to go to the C string. So you want to have your index finger, you want to have that on the third fret of the first string. You want to have your, my bad, you want to have your index finger on the first fret of the second to last string. Your middle finger on the second fret of the second to last string. And then you want this one to be right there so and then we're gonna go count to four and we're gonna do it so one and a two and a three and a four. Oh, I messed up one and a two and a three and a one and a two and a three and a one and a two and a three and a four one and a two and a three and a four now we're gonna do it a little bit trickier we're gonna take our fingers off so I'm gonna do it. One and a two and a three and a four. One. I forgot the strings. <laughs> My bad. Okay. So it was like. Uh, that. It was like that. So one and a two and a three and a four. Take them off, and then put them back on. One and a two and a three and a four. Take them off. Put them back on. One and a two and a three and a four. Take them off. Put them back on. One and a two and a three and a four. So that's the C string. Now we're going to do the um, A string. Okay. We're going to do the A string. So. We're going to do the A string. So. We got... You want to put your pointer finger on the first fret of the second to last string. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. You want to take your middle finger, put it on the second fret of the second string, like that. And then you want to have your middle, your uh, ring finger under that string, like this. Should be like that and you want to play so we're going to count from four one and a two and a three and a four okay one and a two and a three and a four okay one and a two and a three and a four okay one and a two and a three and a four okay so now we're going to do it a little bit trickier like i'm always saying we're going to take our fingers off every time we end there. Okay. I, I kind of don't really know my strings that well, so I'm sorry if it'll take me a couple minutes. So like that. So one and a two and a three and a four. Take them off. One and a two and a three and a four. Take them off. One and a two and a three and a four. Take them off. One and a two and a three and a four. Take them off. One more time. One and a two and a three. And a four. Now it should go like this. So you have. So we need it like this. And then you want to have it like. Wait, it was like. Yeah, I'm doing. I'm, I'm on the right track. Okay. So, and then so. And then, but before we end this video, I got a song I wanted to show y'all. So, if you guys didn't know this one, it goes like this. I keep on hitting the side. Okay. 
so I can't really do it that much. So I had practiced my own little song. And I was practicing to say something, so every once in a while when I learn a new song, I learned Imagine Dragons, but I don't know where my piece of paper went, and I just got that one today from school, so. But, um, next week I should be learning, uh, what was it? It was one of the good ones, uh, but we, we learned Radioactive by Imagine Dragons today. So, um, yeah, quick review. That, and then third fret, no, first fret, boom, oh, I did the wrong, no, I didn't, no, I did okay, I'm on the right track, and then we need, okay, so I'm not that good, okay? It was like that. <laughs> Boom. So that's, oh yeah, that last one is the A minor. I just, yeah, I forgot. So we got a G string, D string, C string, and A minor string. You can do this one on the ukulele too, but I don't have a ukulele. I only have this guitar and I have a broken guitar over there. And you can play it on a ukulele too. So, I got the strings up here on a piece of paper. I was looking at them a bit. To, I, I can't really show you, but I'll get the piece of paper out. So, we got the piece of paper. You can't, you probably can't really see it, but the bottom one is the ukulele ones, if you can really look at it. The bottom ones are the ukulele ones. The top ones are the guitar ones. So, yeah, and we also have... Oh, okay, that's new, so, oh, that, alright, okay, I'm dumb, are you kidding me, there is no way this is Imagine Dragons, Bro, this, hold on. Ah! So you're saying, oh, this one's the wagon wheel one. <laughs> They're the same strings. They're legit the same strings. How can I be so dumb? Bro, they're legit the same strings. I'm so sorry, guys. <laughs> Bro, I'm so confused. C, G, D. Okay, guys. Uh, uh, so, the... This is how it goes for the wagon wheel one. This one is the... Um, the, um... So, I did it wrong. Okay. Next video, I'll go over this, but I want to practice it, and then I might make a video after. So, hope you guys like, subscribe. Hope you guys hit that subscribe button, hit that notification notification bell for more uploads of guitar, so you guys can learn some guitar videos. And stay tuned. And goodbye. Peace out.